वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल मोदी मेकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग टूटोरियल्स सो इन माई प्रीवियस लेक्चर्स इट विल बी सोल्यूशन एंड एक्सप्लेनेशन फॉर सम ऑफ द एम सी क्यूज ऑन टू द मेटल कटिंग प्रोसेस सो दिस इज माई थर्ड सेशन फॉर एम सी क्यू ऑन टू द मेटल कटिंग प्रोसेसिस सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन द अप्रोक्सीमेटली वेरिएशन ऑफ टू लाइफ एक्सपोनेंट एन ऑफ सीमेंटेड कार बाई टूल्स सो बेसिकली ऑप्शन जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री टू जीरो पॉइंट जीरो एट बी जीरो पॉइंट जीरो एट टू जीरो पॉइंट ट्वेंटी सी जीरो पॉइंट ट्वेंटी टू जीरो पॉइंट फोर्टी एट एंड डी पॉइंट फोर्टी एट टू पॉइंट सेवेंटी सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द टेलर्स टू लाइफ इक्वेशन वी टी रेस टू एन डेट विल बी इक्वल टू कॉन्स्टेंट एंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एन जनरली पॉइंट थ्री अराउंड और यू कैन से पॉइंट थर्टी थ्री अराउंड सो डेट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ एन अकॉर्डिंग टू द टेलर्स टू लाइफ इक्वेशन सो दिस वन इट विल बी इन द कैटेगरी ऑफ जीरो पॉइंट ट्वेंटी टू जीरो पॉइंट फोर्टी एट so the approximate variation of the tool life exponent n of the cemented carbide tool is in between 0.20 to 0.48 so the answer c second question the coating materials for coated carbide tools includes the option is tic or you can say titanium carbide titanium nitride and sodium cyanide second one titanium carbide and titanium nitride third or you can say c titanium nitride and sodium cyanide and d titanium carbide and sodium cyanide so basically titanium carbide and titanium nitride that will be the part of the coating tool materials but if you are using nac and or you can say sodium cyanide so that will be having a characteristics in the presence of the salty environments so that will be corroded so that will be not a part of the coating tool materials so in a it will be present in b it will be not present c it will be present and d it will be present so only option with the possibilities for coating materials for coated carbide tools and that will be titanium carbide and titanium nitride so option b tic and ti and that will be the answer of coating tool materials for coated carbide tools the next question 3 which of the following is included in a basic machine tools so let us see the options lathe machines it will be possibilities b production milling machine C production drilling machines and none of the mansion so i think the basic machine tools that will be considering as a lathe machines because lathe it will be the basic machine tools so with the application of the lathe you can make anything so this production milling machine and production drilling machines that will be considering as a special purpose machines in the case of the productions so for the basic machine tools that will be considering as a lathe machine then the next question which of the following is the types of lathe machine capstan lathe b option turret c both the capstan and turret lathe and none of the mansions so in my playlist and the link is given in my description for the basic types of the lathe machines and that will be in detail study of the capstan lathe and the basic difference between capstan and turret lathe so i think the both the capstan and turret lathe that will be the types of lathe machines so the option c but both the lathe machines that will be having a basic difference so for the detailed study of the difference between capstan and turret lathe you should find the theories in my descriptions the next so which machine tool is known as the mother of machine tools so we already discussing into the 
क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री द बेजिक मशीन टूल्स डेट विल बी द लेथ मशीन सो द लेथ मशीन इज कंसिडरिंग एज अ मदर ऑफ ऑल द मशीन टूल्स सो द ऑप्शन ए ड्रिल मिलिंग लेथ एंड नन ऑफ मैं सो द ऑप्शन सी लेथ मशीन इज नोन एज अ मदर ऑफ मशीन टूल्स सो डेट विल बी द बेजिक मशीन टूल्स You should find into any workshop, and you can make anything with the help of lathe machines. So the lathe machine is known as the mother of all the machine tools. Then next question: lowest portion of the side cutting edge is blank of single point cutting tool. So once again, let us see the single point cutting tool. So this is our single point cutting tool. so for more detail study you should find the link in my description so the lowest portion of the side cutting is so this is our face of the single point cutting tool this is our flank of the this is our rack face and heel so this is our heel of the single point cutting tool so heel that will be considering as a lowest portion of the side cutting edge for the single point cutting tool so according to the given options the a that will be heel is considering as a lowest portion of the side cutting edge in the case of single point cutting tool the next factor which affects the tool life is first that will be the tool geometry so in case of the single point cutting tool that will be having a different angles then second cutting speed feed and last option that will be all of the above so basically in detail study of the tool life the all the tool geometry is cutting speed feed depth of cut which is act as an influencing parameters on to the tool life so the factors that will affect the tool life is these all factors so the answer for this question is all of the above so tool geometry feed speed depth of cut which is the factors which will be affect on to the tool life for detail study you will find the link in my descriptions now for the next question the process of improving the cutting action on grinding wheel is known first that will be the truing dressing facing and clearing so the process improving the cutting actions of the grinding wheels it is called as a dressing operations so by the application of the dressings that will be improving the cutting actions on to the grinding wheel the next question hard and tough materials like cast iron should be turned at the options is slow speed b high speed any speed or you can say certain specific speed so basically for cutting of hard and tough materials like cast iron so in case of the cast iron that will be brittle materials so it will be making a segmental chips or you can say discontinuous chips so that will be only controlling by the slow speed parameters for you can easily cut the hard and tough materials or you can say cast iron materials so for this questions answer is a slow speed is being preferred to cut hard and tough materials so the next a single point thread cutting tool should ideally have option a zero rack angle positive rack angle negative rack angle and point angle so basically for cutting of thread onto the workpiece material that will be always preferring zero rack angle so that will be the answer so zero rack angle is apply for the cutting of the thread by the tool materials and positive most of the cases and for negative rack angles generally used for the brittle and hard materials so i think this is the last questions in this video 
So if you like this, then subscribe and share Modi Mechanical Engineering tutorials. Thank you so much.